What is up guys, Jeremy here and welcome back to another video. I'm going to be covering Lock Plus Pro just because I think it's probably one of the best tweaks you can have installed on your device. It is such an awesome tweak. It's probably within my top three of the best you can have on iOS 11. And I wanted to cover it in specific so you guys knew how it worked and what it's all about. So basically Lock Plus Pro allows you to fully customize the look of your lock screen by switching between hundreds and hundreds of different themes. So as you guys can see, my lock screen probably looks a little different. If we swipe down, we can pull down on the Lock Plus Pro menu. You have your themes section. You have a refresh section. You also have the creator. So if you guys want to make your own themes, you can do that. And then there's also a search feature. So if you're searching for a specific theme, you have the ability to do that. So we'll go ahead and jump into the themes section here. Uh, first off is your saved tab. These are all the different lock screens that I have gone through and downloaded and used on my device. So if I ever want to switch back to one, I can just easily select it, click on apply and boom, as you guys can see, the theme of my lock screen has changed. Like I said, this is an incredibly powerful tweak and probably one of the coolest ones you can have on your device. We'll go ahead and go back into the theme section here. Next section is all. This is where you're going to find all of the different themes uh, that you can download within Lock Plus Pro. And like I said, guys, there's hundreds of different themes to choose from. There's so many different themes. You can come up with almost any kind of style for your lock screen. You also have the ability to use the wallpaper that is supplied with the theme, or you can use your own wallpaper, uh, wallpaper which is really cool as well. Uh, and like I said, there is just tons and tons of different designs and different setups you can have for your lock screen. And that's why I think uh, this is definitely one of the best tweaks for iOS 11. One of the best tweaks of all time, in my opinion. This is just such an awesome tweak. So you have your top section as well on the right there. These are kind of the most popular uh, themes that are current. Very cool. Now, we'll go ahead and jump into my device. In order to get Lock Plus Pro, you will have to add a source. We'll go ahead and jump into Cydia here. And I'll go ahead and back out of my sources. The source you'll need to add is called June's iPhone uh, Super Secret. Uh, source. Now I'll leave this listed down in the description so you guys can go ahead and edit and add it into your Cydia. Uh, but once you have the source um, you know, installed in Cydia, you will have to purchase the source. Um, you'll be able to see all the packages that it offers, which are a ton as you guys can see. So it's not only Lock Plus Pro that you get, you just get a ton of different stuff. And anything else that the developer adds to the source, you will have access to because you have paid for the source. So we'll go ahead and go down to Lock Plus Pro. Once you have selected into a package, uh, if you scroll down just a little bit, just below the, uh, the images for the package here, you'll see a login section and then you will also see a purchase section. And like I said, you will have to purchase this. It's normally $10, uh, but if you use the code iDeviceMovies, my channel name, I'll also leave it uh, down below if you guys wanna use it, you'll get it 50% off. You'll get it for $5. And uh, like I said, that includes everything in the source. All the different packages you will unlock for $5. And in my opinion, just Lock Plus Pro alone is worth the five bucks. So it's definitely a really cool tweak to have on your device. Again, I'll leave all the information down in the description for those of you that do wanna download and try out Lock Plus Pro. Like I said, one of my favorite tweaks of all time and definitely one of my favorites on iOS 11. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely throw me a thumbs up. That helps me out a lot here at the channel. And if you guys want to see more videos like this in the future, don't forget to click that subscribe button. This has been Jeremy, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Later.